fashionista Bruno has literally stopped traffic here in Sydney for the premiere of his new film. Sydney's gay capital of Rumsey Van Cloor. shall accept in full flower I just love a little hosen for everybody, I reckon. Hopefully I'm come back now. A little hosen for the world. <laughs> Do you think Aussie guys could learn a thing or two from Bruno? Oh, definitely. Oh. Who couldn't? You know, I thought I'd turn it down a little bit for Bruno because I don't want to steal the, you know, the bride's glory today. So I just turned it down a little bit, tried to do something a little bit demure. Why is it? A, is it a bit Bruno-ish to you? Uh, well, I've already seen it. I'm hosting the red carpet up there, so uh, I'm one of five people that's actually kind of seen it, and uh, it's, it's mental. Does Bruno shock you? Yes, absolutely. I mean, I've seen yeah. a couple of. There's lots of different versions now. It's been edited and edited, and I saw one of the originals, so. I'm pretty sure it will be as shocking, but I don't think anything will shock me as much as the one that I saw to begin with. Is it a good thing though, the controversy? Is it all for a laugh? Yeah, yeah. I think he has, Bruno has this amazing um, element of mystery, but then he's also really upfront and in everyone's faces, so it's kind of perfect. Uh, at the same time, it, I hope it doesn't offend anyone. What are you expecting from the film? Um, just, just basically, um, hi. Just a bit of that, really. <laughs> yeah. Hi, I'm Joyce Mansion. I'm very excited. I'm here with my Joanne horse handbag, and I'm very excited to see Bruno. Looks Sorry. like you're almost trying to outshine Bruno. Uh, no, not at all. I'm just blending in. I've got a few colours that are representative of Australia. So I'm going to show them a few things. Fantastic. Brought my mum along tonight. Well, we're here to see Bruno. How long have you been waiting in line? Uh, we got here at 4.30. So what's the time now? Nearly 7.30. Quite time. So why have you been waiting so long? What do you love about Bruno? <laughs> Bruno, I'm just so excited to be here. I got my uh, autograph stuff to get done, and I've even got two double passes to the movie, and I'm pretty psyched to be here. And yeah, I'm gonna see it. Christmas Australia, yeah, yeah. Hello. I definitely think the Aussie guys can get a fashion tip. You know, a bit of effort might be nice. Well, I decided to go with Camilla, with uh, Bettina Liano and Kristen Louboutin. You can't really go wrong with that. So. And of course, you want to be careful because Bruno is just so out there. You, you want to do the right thing but not outshine him. I nearly wore the mankini, but then I thought no. Well, Richard, Bruno, the man of the moment, is stopping traffic in Sydney. Is this all a bit over the top? What's your impression? I think the man's a publicity genius. He knows how to work a crowd. He knows how to get all the last lot on board. and. Uh, He's, uh, he's done a great job tonight. These images that have been taken by the hordes of photographers, paparazzi, are going to be beamed around the world and it will just uh, you know, make his star even larger. So what are you expecting from the film? It's been pretty sort of outrageous and it's, it's been a bit controversial. Mm. Oh, I think it's great. I love the controversial stuff. I can't wait. <laughs> it's awesome. I think it's funny. <laughs> Enjoy the night. Thank you, Thank you too. Incredibly excited. Look at how many people are here. From what you've seen so far, what do you think of his style? I mean, he's very out there. I don't know how someone can be so politically incorrect and get away with it, but I love it. We love him. So wrong is right. <laughs> well, he stopped traffic here in Sydney. It's the premiere of Bruno, and uh, he's made one hell of a grand entrance. Maximum Please, music.